If you're anything like us, you love to multitask. But with multitasking comes the inevitable browser chaos. Yes, there's 50 tabs that you've got open right now on your screen. Well, today I'm going to show you how to use Wakona and how it can transform that chaotic tab management into something little, okay, a lot more organized to work with, and how it can help speed up your computer by closing down all those unnecessary tabs. So Wakona offers a ton of features that are designed to streamline your online work experience from creating workspaces to organizing all of those tabs and to even sharing resources amongst your team and then syncing everything across your devices. Wakona is a really great tool to help with all of this. So what we're going to do is we're going to dive in and have a look at some of our favorite features. First up is creating workspaces. So imagine having a dedicated desk for each project or topic that you're working on. You may be managing this via a lot of open browser windows or even the saved Chrome group feature that I've demonstrated before. But the way that Wakona works is by taking it to another level. So to create a new workspace, we can just simply click on the plus button, click on new space, and then underneath this, we can name it, add a description, and even choose an icon. So if we give it a name, we can call this test. We can add in any people that we would like to invite in here, and we can add a description. So this might be unsorted tabs that we need to do. So from there, we can click on create space. And what you'll see now is over in the left-hand side, underneath spaces, we have a new one called test. So once you're in here, there's a few different parts to the way Wakona works. So the first thing is we have the resources page. So this is where you can bookmark important documents and links to help you stay organized. So if we take a look over at the company resources example that comes with this, they've come in here and they've created a bunch of different topics and then they've bookmarked different things that relate to the business that might be a quick reference point for the team. From there, we've then got the tab management. So this is where everything comes, the power of this platform comes in. So on the left-hand side, you can currently see all of the different windows that I have open. And then when we click into those, you'll see that we have all of the different tabs that are open within that window. So what we can do is we can actually hover over each of these ones and we can say, move this one to our new test space and click move. So what will happen is when we click on the test space over here and we click on tabs, you'll see it instantly opens up the tabs that are within that space. So it's a really, really great way if we quickly move all of these. So let's just say if we'll get rid of all of these ones. We're going to move them to the test space. And it'll move everything there. So you can see now it's closed down that um, window browser that we had open. And if we click on test, it'll have automatically reopen all of the tabs that are sitting within that workspace as well. So it's just a really cool way of being able to not have all of these running at the same time and slowing down your computer, but instead being able to jump, as you can see now, all of those tabs have now gone just saving those resources and making it quicker and easier to be able to find things. So the other thing you can do here is each space can also have a note section. So if we put in a little note, you can format this however you like, and then we can click enter and it will now save that note for us. So there's a couple of things. We can open it in full screen if you'd prefer a full doc editor. We can open the note in its own tab. We can attach any files or links to this as well. And then finally, if you want different sections too, you can group those as well. And then also within each workspace is you've got tasks too. So in here, just excuse the demo, we can create a task. We can then add in extra information about this if you like. You can pop in your due date time if you want to and then you can also add things like attachments and you can add them into your tasks as well so if I go and click on the task section of Wakona you'll see here that it now comes up with that task that is due today and it will let me know the workspace that's in it so if you're not using a task or a project management tool this task part of this is really really powerful just to help you store things that are going on 
And then finally, the other really great thing I like about this is we can search across a universal search. So all of the platforms that we have connected, we can actually access those. And then with ClickUp itself, we can create new ClickUp folders. We can go to tasks that we've previously done before. It's just a really great quick way of being able to search across all of your different locations as well. So if it's something that you want, you can just go to wakona.com. It'll then pop up the homepage. There are a couple of browser extensions that you do need to install to be able to use this, but I highly, highly recommend it as a way of just being able to really organize those browsers and stop having all of those different tabs going on. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out and let me know.